An association overseeing a historical museum in Gaston County asked to pack up and leave. Well, Queen City News Chief Business Correspondent Taylor Young has been following this back and forth over the Cheerville Historical Museum for months right now, and she has more. After months of back and forth over this historical property on Main Street, the Cherryville Historical Association has received an order from the city to vacate. It doesn't belong to you. It belongs to citizens of Cherryville. Since February, Al Putnam, the president of the Cherryville Historical Association, has stood his ground on keeping the museum where it is and has been since 1984. This is kind of the clerk's office. Earlier this year, a developer in town placed the one and only bid on this city-owned property. Last month, the Cherryville board approved the sale for $400,000. But minutes before the sale was finalized, Putnam filed a lawsuit against the city, claiming the property was sold to the town under the pretext it would be used as a museum. While the city is listed on the deed, Putnam claims ownership through squatters' rights. Again, the state law says that you need to have possession for 20 years. You need to be the sole possession of that. We have been the sole possession of, uh, of this building for all of that time. Despite the court filing, the city of Cherryville is ending its lease with the association. In a letter addressed to Putnam, the city is asking the association to return its keys and vacate the building no later than December 31st. Now Putnam says he will continue to fight to keep the museum here on Main Street until the very end. We did reach out to the city for a comment on that order to vacate the property by the end of the year. It responded by saying it could not comment on pending litigation. Reporting in Cherryville, Taylor Young, Queen City News.